What's up, guys? We're here. Welcome back to the channel. So, again, we got some more um, of our seasonal content in Diablo 3, Season of the Construct, and we have Herald of Malthus, Skazglen. Defeat the Herald of Mal uh, Malthus. Again, this is going to be similar to the previous video where you do the same content to a degree, but now we are doing it as a Tree of Whispers. So this is not only going to be a really cool way to farm up Tree of Whispers, turn-ins for XP, gold, resources, and everything to fight Varshan. But this is just really cool to do the overworld activities for the brand new season while getting Whispers on top of that. I think that's really, really cool if you don't really want to do dungeons or nightmare dungeons, stuff like that. So this one is going to expire. Um, we're going to wait for these to reset, and I'm going to show you guys how to do these um, again just as the reward. It's pretty sweet. So those they moved. Where did they move to? Let's up. Oh, they moved to right here, which is awesome. We got uh, one hour. So they act just like Tria Whisper turn ins and quests that just continuously just reset in the overworld. I think this is something that they really needed. It's think about it like this they kind of took the vamp ties from last season and kind of broke them up, right? Because now we have these kind of seasonal ideas here that just work. We can close this, right? Get our obelisk closed. Boom. Get some more of our elemental cores, which are awesome. We're going to kill these guys. Super cool. Let's try not to get hit by all this. Kill the kill the guardsmen. Sweet. And then again, we're going to come over here. We didn't get the Tree of Whispers yet because we need to defeat the Herald. So if we summon this, we come in here. Let's summon and activate. We should be able to defeat the Herald over here and get credit for the Tree of Whispers turn in. This is actually really, really cool. This should speed up doing your Tree of Whisper turn ins. I think it is amazing for that. Let's go ahead and slam some guys. Wait, what? Let's go ahead and destroy these monsters. <laughs> All right, let's get the Herald to spawn. Let's get the Herald to spawn. Hello, Herald. Boom. You can see we got Herald and Mathis in the dry steps. This is five out of ten of our Tree of Whispers. We got reconstructed, upgraded too. So now you can see that it goes away, right? Because we did it in the dry steps. So when you're going through these, they're going to act just like the Tree of Whispers when you complete a dungeon or you complete the, um, the Seething Abomination. So now he's done here, right? Like he doesn't spawn here. Now we got to wait for the Tree of Whispers to kind of reset. Or we can go to the next area, right? And try to complete these. The more of these that you complete, the faster that they're going to reset. So the more dungeons you complete, the more missions that you complete, the faster that they're going to reset. This is just a really, really quick video, guys, just to kind of showcase some of the more additions that they brought into Season 3. I'm actually really excited, to, uh, excited about it. Because it makes farming tree whispers just easier. So now we have more things to farm, right? We got dungeons, the normal quests here, which frankly are just a little bit slower. You have the seething abomination. And now we have the heralds that we just spawned and killed right here, as you can see, which just adds on top of it. It makes it doing really, it makes it doing tree of whispers just super, super easy and comfortable to do, guys. So like the video, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to subscribe, and as always, stay gaming. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.